Um, not really. And on that play, Pickens was supposed to run a post and basically pull some coverage too. Yeah, I heard he was wide open as well. He so. was. <laughs> yeah. So Jake had his dealer's choice on that one. So yeah. <laughs> what was it like for you sitting there? game and a half and watching kind of the offense sputter a little bit? Um, it wasn't as bad, you know what I'm saying? Um, I get to see, you get to see your guys work. And, and like, for me, that's that's better than watching the film. You get to watch it, you know, you know, obviously as a receiver or as a player, you don't want to get hurt. But when you have the opportunity and, you know, coach coach gave me the blessing to travel and that, that we not a lot of injured players travel. So just being a leader there, have, getting in the guys' ears, especially like George, Matt, you know, guys who, you know, that's just starting to come up and get playing. It, it was awesome. What's it like for you coming from Miami? Now you've got a chance to play in the SEC championship, maybe, coming up. Um, I mean, it's not really, you know, two programs are different, obviously, yeah. ACC and SEC. But, um, you know, it's not really anything different. It's, it's still a team sport, and you still got to play for your team. And, like I said, it's one heck of a team, and I'm just proud of what we keep, keep chopping with. You were talking about the noise. What team do you guys be the noise? Um, a, lot of, a lot of people say that, you know, our receivers, we have no game changers. We have no, you know, no, no playmakers. Um, I heard, you know, um, during the South Carolina broadcast, the second half, I was watching the game. It's like, you know, nobody can get open, blah, blah, blah. You know, just to me, that's just like, you know, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, but, you know, we, we learned to shut it out. I learned, you know, being a vet, um, being playing college football for it. I feel old, but I'm not old. Um, <laughs> you learn, you learn as you keep going to block stuff out, and so that's what I've been doing to, to, to a lot of guys. What did that noise do for your focus, for your energy? I mean, did, did you guys feel off of it at all? I think we did. Um, you know, coming off the bye, we we have we we've been having some heavy practices as receivers for. And uh, I, all the guys have been focused in. I think it reflects on the game as well. I feel like every single person on the team was focused and doing their job. Of course, you've been banged up a little bit. When did you know you were going to be able to come back and play in this ball game? I told you, I wasn't going to miss this game for anything. So if I had a broke leg, I was going to play. You had uh, you didn't have the opportunity to play for it when you were in Miami. Yeah, no. So how, how big of a deal was How much do you think it was? It's actually funny. These guys. It's actually funny because Miami played Florida this year, so I was going to play Florida regardless. Yeah. So um, I, I feel like it was a great opportunity. Like I said, they're a great team, um, great SEC East uh, opponent, and it was just a it was just a great atmosphere. Lawrence, I know you're another one of the guys. You set career highs and catches and yards. I mean, in a big game, a game that you weren't going to miss. I mean, what? Any emotions come with that? I don't seem to explain too many else. Uh, not really. Like I said, um, I'm, I'm more of a team guy. I'm not an eye, eye guy. You know what I'm saying? Whatever I can do to help the team, whether it's you know, what I had today or whether it's making eight blocks. You know what I'm saying? Whatever I can do to help the team, what I would do to help Jake, Swift, O-line, the defense, um, whatever we can do to get the W, I, I'm, that's what I'm here for. Did you have to do anything extraordinary to get ready, to get physically ready? Like, you know, it's a lot of grace of God, a lot of praying, and a lot of healing. Um, that's, that's really what it more is. Nature than, uh, more nature than More nature than nurture. That's really what it was. Yeah. Now you said you were going to miss this game. Was it due to the actual car itself or just because you missed the previous game? Well, I just think it was more of how, how big of a game it was and how much it meant to our team. Um, I wasn't going to miss, like I said, I wasn't going to miss the game for anything. Lawrence, have you ever played in this game before? Is it as good watching it as it is winning? Describe what you felt going out there. Um, yeah, it was uh, it's a crazy atmosphere. Um, I've never seen a stadium split in half of fans. That was weird. Uh, but it's, it, I don't know, just to me, it seemed like our fans were louder than their fans. Don't quote me on that. I'm just saying. Um, but it was a great atmosphere. Um, like I said, it was two great teams battling each other out to the to the last possession. And what a, what a game it was. When you came out in the South Carolina game, I learned a couple of things about you. You were really solid. You learned that you were playing with a separate shoulder and then into the ribs. You can correct me if I'm wrong on that. And then how much this team actually means you. I know you don't want to talk about yourself, but do you want to change your body about what you want to do? Um, I mean... It's, it's kind of like in my face, so I, I have to see it. But like I said, I'm here. I'm just here for the team. That's what basically what I did for the grad transfer. I'm just here to, for the betterment of the team. Whatever the team wants me to do, whatever they need me to do to help to get the, to get the win, that's what I'm here for. You probably haven't seen it yet. You had a career day today. Tell me how you feel after having this kind of I'm hungry. <laughs> For what? For food? For food, actually. Oh, okay. um, but, uh, yeah. So I, I saw it was blowing up, but uh, I mean, that's, I'm just a, I'm just a style guy. Like, you know, I like to dress nice. So 
maybe people saw it as a big deal, but you know, to me it was just like a, you know, I mean, it's a nice suit now, don't get me wrong, it's a nice suit. But, you know, uh, I'm just a style guy, it wasn't like a, a statement, it was just like a, you know, I just like to dress nice.